In the majestic setting of Lviv's organ hall, a performance by a brass ensemble that includes members of the Luhansk Philharmonic Orchestra. Located in eastern Ukraine, they found themselves in the path of invading Russian forces. Now they can rehearse and perform once more in the relatively peaceful West, where they've sought refuge along with thousands of others. I have mixed emotions. On one hand, we are very pleased to be able to perform as musicians. But there's the worry of playing in front of a different audience, and not as a full orchestra. The venue is a former church that dates from the 17th century and that can boast the largest organ in the country. It's one of the architectural treasures that makes Lviv the cultural soul of Ukraine. The building was just starting a major renovation when the war broke out, bringing work to a halt. But not the business of making music. Culture shouldn't be silent. We need to say we're not afraid. We exist. We are here. That's why this concert is very important for the musicians and audience to boost people's spirits. In the audience, many people who were also evacuated from the East. The fate of the orchestra representing the shared experience of all Ukrainians. Of the nearly 100 members of the orchestra, around a dozen have come to Lviv, with about the same number remaining in Luhansk. The rest have been scattered in cities and towns, mainly across western Ukraine, with some even going abroad. This concert keeps alive the hope that one day they'll come together as a full symphony orchestra once more. More concerts are already being planned, hopefully involving more musicians as they pick up instruments again and take to the stage. War or no war. Rob McBride, Al Jazeera, Lviv.